Hello kindergarten, today we are going to be making Metapec suns. These suns originated in a city known as Metapec, Mexico. The first thing that we're going to do is get our two styrofoam circles that I've already cut out for you. Then we're going to flip them over and write our name and code on the back. This is very important. Do not forget to write your name and your code on the back. I'm going to write K and then maybe a W for Miss Wardley. The next thing I'm going to do is flip my circles back over and get some glue. Now we don't need a whole lot of glue, just a little bit to cover the whole circle, not too thick, and place it in the center of my bigger circle. So that's going to be my sun on my outer circle. Now I'm going to cut five, five squares out of this gray foam. So we've already had the squares cut, one, two, three, four, five. Now I'm going to cut them in half to make triangles. See how they're triangles now? So as long as you cut right through the middle, through the middle, then you're going to get 10 triangles from your five squares. Gotta be careful when you do it. So once we have all of our triangles cut, we need to place them to find out where we want to put them on the sun. You can put them long ways or tall ways. So I'm going to place mine all the way around and see what it looks like. I'm not going to glue them first because I want to see what my composition is going to be before I glue them. So as long as I don't glue them first, I can change them around if I want to. See, I needed to scoot them over a little there. You might even need to flip them over a couple of times to make your son the best son you possibly can. Now that that's all done, I'm going to pick up one at a time and glue them down. This is pretty simple, but it does take a little bit of time, so I sped it up. Now remember, you don't need too much glue. I'm just putting a little bit of glue on each one, just enough. Now that I've glued all of those down, I'm going to take these foam shapes, fun and colorful foam shapes. We have squares and circles and hearts and even some triangles, and we have them in all different sizes. Now, the color isn't going to matter too much because when we do part two on your next class, we're going to cover them up anyway. So you don't have to worry about color, but we do want to worry about symmetry. Notice if I'm using these squares for the eyes and these circles for the cheeks, I want to make sure that they're the same on both sides. I don't want for them to look any different. So I don't want to put a circle and a square for eyes. That's not right. So let's fix that. So those squares are kind of looking like diamonds, and then we have those circles for our cheeks, and I'm going to use a little heart for our mouth. But everything is symmetrical. It's the same on both sides. Now that I have that the way I want it, I'm going to glue everything down. Now, if you mess up your symmetrical composition a little bit, it's okay because the glue will still be wet and you can change it or slide your shape over just a little bit so that it's perfect. And that is our step one for our Metapec Suns. When they're done, they'll be lucky.